Hello and welcome to Opus Tutorials. In today's video, I'll show you how to design a product page, a single product page for WooCommerce. Why I'm making this video? Uh, as you can see that many themes, most of the themes have a single page template or uh, any of their page templates and uh, you cannot do about uh, the design you cannot do anything about the design you cannot change the placement of the title description the add to cart button the image the description reviews uh, they are um, exactly the same as uh, they are in that theme so in this video I'll show you how you can customize or how you can build your own template just like this you can see my screen this is the template the single page template which I built for my WooCommerce page WooCommerce site if I disable this template from uh, the dashboard, let's come to Elementor templates, stem theme builder. If I disable this, then uh, let me show you what, what will be the result. Single product. Edit conditions. And remove. Let's see how it will look like now. So this this will be the default Astra theme uh, single page for WooCommerce. I'm using Astra theme and they have uh, this template. But if I activate my my uh, single page which I showed you earlier, let me update it. Now if I refresh the page, then you will see the difference. And this is our template which I'll show you how you can build for yourself. So first of all, you will need Elementor Pro and Elementor Free, both both uh, plugins, free and pro. So uh, if you come to your dashboard, uh, you must install and activate Elementor Pro. I'm using Astra theme, you can use any theme or uh, if you have already a theme installed uh, on your website then you can use that as well these templates will work for for almost any theme <coughs> now uh, open elementors templates templates then click on theme builder now let me f let me first disable that single product template now for building a new template, click on single product. You can make any of them single post, single page, archive, search result, product archives, error page, 404, header or folder. But I'm building a single page. Click on this add icon. Now it will load the Elementor page builder. which you can only see for uh, building pages, not templates. But in this video, I'll show you how to build templates. For, uh, for, for this particular video, I'm showing you the single page template. There are uh, four different types of four different variations of templates available in pro version, uh, but I'm not using them. Uh, I'll show you how you can build your own. You can use them as a base. Uh, for example, if you use this one, click on insert then you can customize that uh, for according to your needs like this for example let's move the title uh, these are the post matters or uh, attributes these are the attributes colors manufacturer assemble product with height dimensions uh, you can change placement like move add to cart above the price or uh, even move add to cart to the top normally we do not do that but uh, I'll just showing you I'm just showing you because you need to customize your page so add to cart and uh, the date will be uh, sorry the price will be on the top click on publish add condition the condition means uh, for which post type you want to show your template so uh, as I selected the product from my template when I created it, then uh, it will show me mm, exactly those uh, things in this drop down menu. You will have to select the products. When uh, anyone opens a product, then this template will be loaded. So click on save. We have our conditions ready. 
now if you come to the front end and refresh the page then this is exactly that template which we uh, used for this which we just built you can see the add to cart and price uh, price are on top uh, there is a thumbnail description reviews now let's add some related products to the bottom go to the bottom of the page we have related products but uh, as we do not have uh, any a lot of categories in these uh, products that is why it's not showing on my front end but you will have uh, the related products here we already have it in our template now if you come to the elements there are a lot of elements you uh, you can use breadcrumbs there are breadcrumbs here if you want to remove it remove it and add uh, anywhere you want like on the top of the title on the top of the image or let's scroll down if you want to add breadcrumb here oh no this is this is the template not that one and we do not have related products here okay okay let me show you uh, if you come to the elements you can search for related products or type okay th these are the product related add it here and click on update if you refresh the page then uh, you will be able to see the related products below the original single product so this is quite neat and clean uh, template which you can build for yourself uh, there are a lot of other elements related to the single product as uh, we built a single product then it will show show us all the single product related for example the add to cart the product rating uh, you can see there is no product rating on this site uh, this template so if you want to add it you can add it like this or maybe this is the element okay the, this is the element product rating already similarly product images these are the product images already there product price this one or a product stock uh, there is no stock status maybe yes no stock status so let's add the stock as well you can add the title here or maybe they already have the title let's see I do not manage my stocks that is why it's not showing but uh, it will show the stock if you uh, have it on the back end let's add a title uh, this is not the title this is the product title which is this one we want to add our own title so type title here grab that title here and let's change it to p stock and then this or uh, let's just add inner sections let's grab the stock to the, the first one There is a JavaScript error, but you can grab the stocks uh, stock value here and the stock title here, just like that. When you publish it, then at least you will see the title if there is no stock mentioned. Here, stock and the stock value will be there. Uh, you can manage the alignment like uh, let's centerize the elements and this one as well from the style or typography uh, maybe it's already centralized okay uh, there are a lot of other elements if you have any question then uh, you can leave it in the comment section 
if you like this video then please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel if you want to uh, see more of my videos and you will be notified if you want to uh, press the bell icon thank you